Hey guys, so I hope you are doing well and today I thought of just sharing a few things. Before that, I want to show you a pretty small amount of vlog that I have done because we just recently had our ground sectioning and if you don't know what ground sectioning means and you're into dentistry or maybe this time you are going to get dentistry and you are going to do that. So yeah, it's pretty much a small details about how ground sectioning looks like and what is the machine that has been used to do that and yeah. So here is the video. So today is the first day we are gonna do our ground section of tooth. First is the anterior that is incisor canine and then we have to do the molars. Premolars are not like used in ground section and uh, I just forgot to bring it. I had and she is looking very beautiful. And and the neck neck piece it's, it's very nice. <laughs> So we are gonna do the ground section. I don't know. Uh, they had suggested us to this pump uh, by just going through the explanation of the ground section things, the topics we have to do in first year. But we haven't done anything. Like we had one class, but wanna explore how it goes and see what happens. We are done for today's what was that? <laughs> Ground sectioning of tooth. Okay, and so we ate our khana. Yeah. Khajana. But I don't think I can do it. Ground no. section of tooth. <laughs> Sir got electrical shock. <laughs> so our uh, molar teeth was not done because you know how can we just do it? Because water was there and the machine was there. So for that reason we did only one. There were some electrical issues by which Sir and other students got yep. the shock. Okay, and this is for uh, group B, and you can hear what happened in group A. Okay, just tell them. Well, I will let fire. Well, she like base plate demo there. Well, it caught on fire. The tooth, sir. No, not the tooth, the base plate. Oh, base plate. Base plate. <laughs> <laughs> she like base plate? Yeah, it caught on fire when uh, sir gave it to a few of our students to, <laughs> to do. <laughs> So this is it is not going to come in our professional examination but we have to know and it carries marks guys so yeah of course that is important so recently i have been thinking about telling you a important thing that you have seen in my thumbnail that whether dentists use stethoscope or bp measuring machines or kind of those stuffs what mbbs doctors do do they use that i mean yeah that was a pretty nice question because I was your age and like in the past if somebody would say that dentists wear stethoscope and they use it I would rather be very surprised and would say like really that's cool so so I get you guys and in India I don't think many people vlogs like the dentist community really is not that much populated right now I was not aware of a lot of things that is gonna come in the way if you study dentistry and uh, this is kind of a social thing because you know we have grown up watching doctors wearing the stethoscope and I guess it's pretty cool thing to look like when you take photographs and it's kind of pretty responsible thing I guess because my teacher used to say to me that you know it's like a jewelry you are wearing a jewelry like women's wear this like I'm wearing right now this uh, chunk of jewelry so it is our jewelry which is far more costlier than any gold diamond it carries a huge amount of responsibility respect and of course that is the only reason why stethoscope carries so much of what is that called heaviness okay comment down below what is that called like dignity I say it is responsible I don't know. okay okay let's move on so yeah that is the thing and recently we have the class on measuring the pulse rate how to measure the bp or the blood pressure by like what is that called okay i will say it one time spignomanometer spignomanometer okay that was the thing i think so yeah i always startle when i 
pronounce this thing so yeah that is the instrument and we had the classes we are pretty excited about those things because you know like doctory in doctory we need to use those stuff those are like instruments for being a doctor and it carries a lot of responsibilities and knowing those stuff is pretty cool and pretty interesting so yeah i was very excited to do the classes and we have those things on our practical examination for the professional exam which is very close like knocking at our doors so yeah and uh, that was it so i hope that you understand right now that yeah we use all those stuff and i have said it in this part of video i think so also we went to the college street and my friend they bought their stethoscope which was also a very nice experience i didn't had to buy because yeah again my father had so my friends they they went and one of my friends she bought and that was very 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 nice experience you know like after entering into a college after, after like so much hustling and then entering and then uh, buying those stuffs because we achieved it uh, is a pretty good experience and uh, yeah that was it for this video and it was kind of a chit chat also a little vloggy thing so please do let me know in the comment section below that whether you like a whole vlog thing or like this kind of chit chat like bilky bath kind of thing and you people listen just about my experiences is it interesting is it cool or is it just like boring i will appreciate whatever you say so yeah do let me know in the comment section below also give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel if you are new so that whenever i upload a new video you will get it so also do click on the notification bell icon i would really really love to share all my experiences you know many people they ask me whether the interest is stable or not like uh, in india or what about the money and i just see what i literally know because i don't know anything i'm just here for 9 months i just entered into the dental college i have no idea and i'm just experiencing things and i'm just telling you i cannot superimpose anything that is not true and i have not experienced so of course i will always always say what i have experienced and maybe somebody else has experienced something else so they will say, share their part so my part is sharing my thing so that you get the point you know before you are in that area you experience yourself also you know things from my mistakes and what i have done what has helped me uh to achieve any certain thing so yeah that is it for today's video i hope you are doing well i know the net results are going to be out very soon so i hope best for you guys and yeah take care of yourself don't stress too much i know what happens so watch my other videos other vlogs to relieve the stress you know have fun you need to study a lot but also like like the quote says like study hard and party harder so that is the thing and yeah i will see you guys next time bye bye